Hey everybody, it's Gamaragi. We're back with Legend of Mana. Last time we helped Lark take out the first of his three dragons. It was really scary and yeah, I was a little bit I was a little bit worried, but uh, we took it out. And uh, oh yeah, we got our first pet. Uh, it's still an egg though, I think. We'll check on that uh, really quick. But first, I want to forge a sword. What is going on? Hi. I just built a shop for making instruments that play music. Up the stairs on the right. This week's assignment is build an environment to make your uh, building an environment to make instruments yourself. So I built a shop right here. My assignment will be done once I get an elemental coin. Can you help me? I suppose. Looks like we're doing enchanted instruments 101 instead of what I just said. Alright, thanks. You get elemental coins by playing music to elemental spirits. But they'll only give you one if they like your song. Come on, let's go look for a spirit. I... okay. Oh, how convenient. Wow, an elemental spirit! <laughs> I've never seen one here, ever. They never come to places like this, where there are so many people. We're so lucky! Let's try to get a coin. Okay. Here, use this instrument. A flow harp. It's got mad flow, yo. Try playing a song you like. If the spirit likes it, it will come over here. If it doesn't like it, then it will disappear right away. So try to pull it closer and talking to it. And if you succeed, you'll get an elemental coin. Okay. Let's go for a soft song. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh, main. Actually, the more instruments you use, the better chance the spirit will come closer. That's why you should use as many as possible, but right now, one is fine. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if they like it or not. They seem to. Jamming good! The spirit likes it too! Find the right time to put away your instrument and talk to the spirit. Now! Talk to it before it disappears! <laughs> Hurry! Woo! I received some coins. Okay. Wisp Silver. Two. Three. I got three of them. All right, that's how you get a coin, or three. Actually, it's a first, t uh, first for me too. I just did it the way I was taught. All right then, you got your coins, so let's go back to the room I made. Okay. Woo! Well, I'm done with my assignment now. Now you can make enchanted instruments. Have fun. Is there anything you want to ask me about? Uh, yeah, how do I do it? Instruments can be made with primary materials and elemental coins. Make the body of the instrument with a material like Menos Bronze, and add the coin to make it into an enchanted instrument. Material and coin you use determines the type of magic. Okay. What are the coins for? Coins give magical effects to instruments. The song's magic type is determined by the material and coin's properties. And be sure to check whether the coin is gold or silver. It will affect the instrument's power and type of magic. Okay then. See ya. Oh yeah. Can I have two of the wisp silvers? Uh, I'll trade you these coins I got from my friends. Or a silver. Sala silver. And a metal bronze. What do you know? See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. <laughs> uh, thanks, man. That came out of nowhere. Instruments finished. I actually haven't made any. <laughs> now my master can make more instruments in the backyard workshop. Wow, master is really learning how to pick on those monsters. Hey, I'm a decent music player. They kind of play themselves, so don't worry about it, dude. <laughs> so judgmental. 
Okay, as I was going to do, I'm gonna see if I can forge that sword now. Zip, 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 dip, dip. Ba da 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 ba da 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 I don't know if this is going to be better than what I have, but I think it's one of the f like few materials you can use that you can upgrade to be like the best kind of weapon in the game, so I'm definitely going to make that. Okay, let's see how good it is though. <laughs> you may have to upgrade it before it's any good. Wow, I have a lot of stuff. This is a one-handed sword? There it is. 43! Wow, it's actually better. Right on. Well, good thing I made it then. Okay, let's make an instrument too. Since he was so nice to give us all that fancy stuff. Okay, let's make uh, a drum with bronze and uh, Sala, because that's like fire, and Gorons use drums sometimes, and they live in fireplace. Yeah, Menos drum. And Salamander! Ooh, la, 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 la. Flame Launcher, Fan Fire. Okay, so yeah, I think the instruments are also how you use magic. So now we have two magic spells that we can use. Uh, I can't remember how good the magic really is. I think the special techniques are pretty much just as good. <laughs> We can try those out. Um, let's see. Let's set them to magic. Oh, I had a flow harp. When did I? Oh, did he give that to me? Tsunami, Undyne, Sphere, Fire. Oh, Undyne is the element. Huh. Menostrum. Oh, I guess it's just one ability. I, I don't know. Interesting. Alright, we'll set the flow harp to the other one. Okay, <laughs> we'll see what those do. Eggy? Are you... Are you in here? <gasps> the beast egg hatched! Name monster. Hmm... What should we name it? How about... Um... I'm terrible with names. Let's just go with Peter. For like Peter Cottontail, you know? Peter. Here comes Peter Cottontail. Biting you on the ankles, yeah. Take a pet. Feed. Graze. Sell. Oh, you can just sell them right here. Okay. Let's take it with us. Level 1 Peter Rabbit. Oh, God. Don't die, Peter. Do let down. <laughs> He's so happy. Oh, look at him. Boingy, boingy. Oh, great. Oh, that's fantastic. Okay, cool. Um, ba -ba -bum -bum. Ba -da -ba -bum. Ba bum Hmm. So, okay, we could take on the second dragon, or we could try to get that experience share, maybe. Hmm. I guess we kind of did that instrument thing unexpectedly, so. I am going to do something else unexpected and do experience share instead. <laughs>
We could do dragons later. We could do dragons later. Don't worry. I hope I know where I'm going, though. Oh wow, he even shows up on the map, just like a just like a normal person. Uh, I think we have to go in here. Maybe. Um. Hello. Hmm. Maybe not. Maybe it was the item shop. Can't remember. I, ugh, I read it like a week or two ago. <laughs> We'll go in the back room. I think that's where we have to go. Hey, he's running the shop now. Ha! Must be his day. Hey, Tipo. Mark's dream when we was a... When he was a lad was to go to outer space on a rocket ship. Childish, right? Rachel's sick of him, too. I don't know. Maybe he will go on a rocket ship one day. Hey, Rachel. Typical girl's room, don't you think? Don't laugh. My dad picked it all out. Your dad did. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, okay. That was not the right place. Hmm. <laughs> Here? Hello? Say, what do you know about the mana tree? I know a lot. You don't have to play along. There's no such thing. I know that. What happens to your soul after you die? Uh, it lives forever. I think so too. I've been wounded a hundred times, but no one has ever hurt my soul. I can't believe that something could happen to my soul. You know, I want to go meet Gaius. Alrighty. Thank you. I knew you would say that. Let's go. Wisdom of Gaius. Well, this is unexpected too. I don't know if this is what I want to do or not, but we're going to do it. There are a lot of quests in this game, so... <laughs> as long as we're doing something, I think that's good. I think that's a good thing to do. And I even know where Gaius is, so no biggie. Mr. Gaius on Luan Highway. Let's go. Ask me anything. Mm. Uh, Mr. Pink? Boink. Are you gonna teleport us to Gaius? That would be real nice. Oh, he teleports us to this. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> I remember going up at some point. Dude. Oh my god, please stop. Crazy squid. Rabbite, huh? how you liking jumping around in the open air? You liking it? Look, she runs on all fours. <laughs> That's awesome. Like a real cat lady. He's shooting stars! Peter! Hey, Gaius. We're here to see you. Welcome, my children. Come closer. Yes. Hello there. What can I do for you? My friend is about to die from a demon's curse. What can I do to help her? Do what your friend wants you to do. She doesn't ask me to do anything for her. She's just going to accept what's going to happen. And you must accept that. Did you understand what that person said to you? No, I didn't. She was so strong-willed. The demon weakened her, both in body and in spirit. I only wanted her to... 
uh, want to help her regain her former self. People have the power to change themselves. That is what she is trying to teach you. Listen to her words. Thank you. I will try to think about this calmly. Come again, my children. Gaius, you're so wise. You're a wise guy. <laughs> well, thank you so much. I feel a lot better now. Please, take this. Forbidden ring? Well, well, well. Eh. Back home we go. Okay. Let's see how good that is. Or what it is. <laughs> um, three magic defense? Okay, that's not that great. I guess I could have done that a long time ago, though. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Big face. Mm-hmm. The biggest. Oh yeah, that was number three on the quest here. <laughs> a big face on a mountain? It's hard to believe, but my master saw it, so I guess it's true. It knows and doesn't know lots of things. What an amazing world. It knows and doesn't know lots of things. <laughs> so do we. Man, so do we. We're basically Gaius incarnate. Uh, okay, well, that didn't even take that long. Hmm. All right, well, I guess I'll just keep looking around Domina for random things to do. Oh, uh, actually guys, I just read this forbidden ring that we got. Uh, it is the experience share ring. It doesn't actually say anywhere, apparently, <laughs> so... Uh, I don't think. Unless I'm just missing it somewhere. But I'm gonna use it. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Oakwood ring. That's all it really says. And it has three magic defense. But apparently that's it. That's the experience share. So, whatever. I'm not going to do a Domina quest after all. I'm going to do something else. Namely, uh, I guess this dragon bone. Let's just, let's just do the dragon. Whatever. Let's do it. And wouldn't you know it, it goes right up over next to the Norn Peaks. I think think, I think, I think, I think, I think, I think, yes it is! Go! The Bone Fortress? Oh my god, it even roared and everything. It's really scary. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go get Lark. And then I'll meet you over there. The field trip? What? Is that the name of the quest I'm trying to do? <laughs> We're gathering herbs that grow on the hill. Good for you. The Bone Fortress is full of scary, scary skeletons. Don't you mean spooky, scary skeletons? We go to the Academy of Magic. We're working on a triple reagent mixing assignment. Triple reagent? And this, this, the scene is said we should mix stuff with reagents around here. We're having no luck at all. Even the flowerlings are helping us, but we've had nothing but duds. Could you go gather three reagents for me? Bring them back, I'll mix them. Oh god, I think we're on another quest right now. <laughs> what the? Ah! Uh, mummy person? Miss. This, this niece, this, this 
The snee... The zenus? <laughs> the... The zenus. The zenus. Man. Woo, that name. So she's your teacher. It's alright, we're working hard. Good. Woo! Teacher's way too scary. No joke. What the heck? I'm making some potions. Since ages past, people have said the plants on the hill contain the power of mana. Well, isn't that nice? I guess we gotta go collect some. I'm so tired. Keep working. Fairy scales. I found some ulipen. I'm so tired. Here's a gypsy tooth. Was that three? Did I do it? <laughs> well, I'll give it a shot. Hmm, one of them is okay. Uh-oh. This is a puzzle. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> one of them is okay. Okay. Let's see what else we got going on. There's so many people. Star Sparkles. Roly Poly. A rat tail. Hmm, one of them is okay. Okay. Whew, process of elimination, I tell ya. This is gonna take me a bit. <laughs> Hmm. Could go ask the fortune teller in Domina? Uh, nah. Ah, uh, almost. I think we're really getting... Uh, we're getting really close. Okay, I think I found two of them. Fairy scales is good. And spotted silver mushrooms are good. Okay, cool. One more. One more. So close. Oh, we did it! It was Star Sprinkles. Oh yeah. Okay, so Star Sprinkles, Fairy Scales, and Spotted Silver Mushrooms. And they wanted me to talk to the lady. Ha! Ha 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 ha! Oh, ho, ho. I probably should have. Alright, we've made some triagram. Okay, good. Is it like try again? When little kids take this, it makes their heads explode. Oh! Well, isn't that lovely? One time, Bud drank some of this by mistake, and he ran around all day. Can't give you any triagrin. But here, take this. An oblong seed. Well, okay. Field trip. Complete. <laughs> well... We just keep running into unexpected things, don't we? Maybe I should just end it there. <laughs> oh, whatever. You know, I didn't want to fight a dragon today anyway. It's fine. Hey. We got three quests done in one episode. That's, that's great. Blammo. Uh-huh. Heads explode. Yep. That's what they sound like. Picking up stuff from the ground, mixing them, and making them go boom. Isn't that a little bit childish? Didn't your mommy tell you not to do things like that? <laughs> um... Uh... Well, no, not specifically, but... I think that would be pretty fun to do anyway. <laughs> uh, yeah. Anywho, sorry we didn't end up fighting a dragon, but we did get an experience share ring. We got our new pet. Mr. Peter Cottontail over here. Bouncing and bouncing. <laughs> so adorable. Oh my gosh. Uh, and yeah, and I guess next time we'll go back to the Bone Fortress with Lark and hopefully fight a dragon. Yeah, I, I think it's supposed to be there. I mean, it makes sense. There'll be a dragon there. I don't know. Anywho, see you guys next time. Bye bye.